lab 3b manage azure resources by using arm templates we are going to see the task to create an azure managed disk by using an arm template so here using the arm template we are going to create the azure managed disk okay let's log into the azure portal portal.azure.com and search for deploy a custom template deploy a custom template click on it click on build your own template in the editor in the edit template blade click on load file so in the previous task we have downloaded the the json file template.json and parameters.json select template.json file click open so here we are going to remove some of the following lines source resource id and source uri and os type and next hyper v generation default value and type and under resources just remove the os type line So the parameters that we have removed are not applicable for this deployment. So these are applicable if you are, you know, creating the disk from an existing VHD file. So click on save. Next, edit parameters and click on load file now select the parameters.json file and click save and here select the resource group so i'm going to select rg1 and leave the region and disk name I'm going to give 3b disk one disk q standard lrs disk size 32 gig create option empty disk encryption set type encryption addressed with the platform key network access policy allow all so leave the other option as a default and click on review create okay the validation passed click on create so the deployment is in progress Let's wait to complete this deployment. Okay, so that deployment has been completed.
so in the next task we'll be reviewing the arm template based deployment of the managed disk that we just deployed go to the resource group in rg1 where we have deployed the disk using the arm template settings size performance okay rg1 so under settings section you see deployments and this is the first one that we have just created Just review the inputs and the templates section. So in the next lab, 3C, we will see how to manage Azure resources using the PowerShell.